Alright, we got team two. We found some new recruits. What? Okay. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna work my way up there. Alright, we're here, we're at the top. It's never a good sign when you can stand on it. Whew, that's bad, that sinks. So what we're gonna do is, uh, we're all gonna wear masks, obviously. And then we're going to get in there and try and peel this top layer off, huck it right out the side, let it roll down the bin. Then we'll clean it up here later. We don't have a bucket that will go this high. And we're talking like a lot of buckets. Ready? I need a mask. In the bin, you guys, some pretty big chunks. That's like six inches there, maybe not quite four for sure. We're trying to find. So, uh, there's good chickpeas underneath here. See, those are good. We just got a bad layer on here, so we're just gonna jam it in some buckets. We need the one with the rope on it, that way, he, then he can drag it up. Uh -huh. Jared's up on top, he'll have a rope. We're gonna get a rope on some of these buckets. Then he's just gonna drag them out the top and dump them out the side. And again, we're not putting them into anything because we got nothing that we can put them into right now. Hey Jared. We'll scrape that up all later, it won't be no big deal. Can you let the rope in? Yummy! So what we're doing again, we're just taking these big chunks off. We've got masks on, not to breathe in any of this mold dust. We don't really want to go to the hospital here anytime soon. Hey Jared, pull it up. We got Jared at the top with two ropes. Then he's gonna dump it right on the side of the bin here. There it is. We'll clean all that up later. So these chickpeas went in dry and they're clean, which means they're clean for seed. There's no pods or anything in them. And uh, they went in dry, oh, I think last summer, I do believe. So chickpeas do not keep well at all. If you want to keep a chickpea, you put it in a bag. Otherwise, you'll do this all the time. So this is a normal thing, unfortunately, when you're working with chickpeas. The good thing is that this is just a hopper bin, so it's not very big, right? The bad thing is, is if you put this in a 57,000 bushel bin, you have a 50 foot diameter to do this to. And you know what, in those bins, it seems it spoils faster, so uh, you have to probably do that every, you probably gotta skim this stuff probably every, okay. maybe three to six months. And it's not that fun. But we're gonna get her here. I gotta get to work before Frank starts hucking rotten grain at me. And uh, yeah. All right, we resorted to just hucking these big ones out. Frank, you're doing awesome. I'm gonna get to work. Woo! Okay, so now we got most of the big chunks off the top. Now we gotta go around and uh, try and sift through some of this crap. And we're looking for the edges, so, for example, there's a thick line right about this wide that goes probably all the way down the side of this bin. There's actually nothing we can do about that, so, as we empty out the bin, the grain that's peeped up like this is gonna go down like this, and then it's gonna start going down the side of this wall. This rotten grain could fall off and drop down. That'd be a sucky situation. Yeah! And then, uh, I don't know what's going on there. Are you confused, Dad? What? Are you confused? Okay. 
Okay, guys, we're done. Frank. You're awesome, buddy. We're done. Whew. So, a lot different than what it used to look like, eh? Much better. Much better. So this is a normal routine, you guys. You want to grow chickpeas? This is it. Nummy. What? I think we should probably go and change our clothes to get the mold off all of our stuff. My eyes are even getting irritated a little. It's all the mold. Oh. Next time you guys are eating some gabanza beans in your salad, remember me. We made it possible for you. Ha! All right, let's go. Accomplished. Mission accomplished. Look at all this mold on me. Wow. Whew. All right, I'm gonna go down the bin. Not that way, I'm gonna take the ladder. Yep, that's how I'm gonna go. I like your uh, your black eyes you got going on there. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't know, do I have the same thing going on? You probably can't tell. No. Yeah, but your hood's covered. Oh, my hood's covered? Yeah. Okay. So. We're good. Mission accomplished. We did it, Brian. Yeah, we did it. All right, that's Frank. We're off. We're going to go shower. Put a new set of clean clothes on because we just stink. And I don't mean with B.O. So, uh, I'm going to go wash out my eyes here a little bit. They're getting a little agitated. And uh, we got a little bit of a rain here last night. So, uh, I think we're going to be able to have a little bit of time to treat some seed and uh, get ready to go and start seeding these chickpeas. All right. Look at this handsome man. You're so handsome. Can you sit? Sit? Okay. Good boy. What a good boy. Just got back from uh, out of the shower here actually because I needed to clean all that mold out of my nose and out of my eyes. And man, do I feel good. But anyway, ran into a serious problem. Uh, so yesterday was Sunday. We typically take Sunday off around this camp. But Ash and I, we still had to go to town so I could get fitted for a suit and try on some different suits, look at some different suits and so on and so forth. So it was still a fairly busy day. But, uh, but when we came back last night, you know, we're just throwing a whole pile of stuff together. We're trying to get ready, you know, kind of prepare the coffee, prepare the food, prepare everything, you know, go to bed. Woke up this morning, you know, we already shoveled the top off a of bin. Come back in, shower, like I said, realize I don't have any underwear. I forgot to throw my wash in last night. <laughs> I'm like, gosh, come on. So anyway, we're just gonna leave it at that. It's funny for you, but not for me. So anyway, uh, we're gonna have to address that. But I think Ashton wanted to show me some flowers. Ashton is camera shy. She does not like being in the camera. This is Ashton's garden. Check, that's a weed. That's a weed. Check out my rhubarb. Look at oh, that yeah. little thing. You know the, ouch. We're gonna have so my, many good things from this plant. I totally just dipped my, uh, I don't know what this thing is called, into my coffee. And this is one of Mike's plants. He planted this thing, I think. Actually, I think that was here since the beginning of time. Hmm. Cool. Like, like Noah's time, like Noah's Ark. And the peas are not up. No, they're not. But we got somewhere. Somewhere in here we have a potato. Here it is. A little potato plant poking through. And I think another one wants to come through too. Bentley, get out of the garden. No. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Don't pet him. Well, he was out of the garden. Okay, we gotta go. Apparently I give Ashton the camera and... And she's like, all of a sudden, in film mode. <laughs> all right, ready to head back to the farm and get to work. <laughs>